Oh, he was looking at me like, what are you doing? What are you doing here? Alright, here we are. It's pulling away quite a bit. We'll light it in the burner, try to catch up. Alright. A little bit aft, obviously. That's alright. Alright, this jet's wanting to get airborne. So I'll start pulling up as well. It's heavy too, because we got a lot of bombs. There we go, she's almost breaking ground. There we go. Gear coming up. Thanks for the form takeoff, bro. See ya. Alright. Alright, I'm going to look for a place to drop these tanks off. Tanks are gone. Unpopulated area before we get to the strip. That's what I want. All right. Fuel check's good. Now let's make our way to an epic flyby of the Vegas Strip. I feel like this should be a show. They should have a Vegas show called Fighter Pilot. And they do it like twice a week where they just rage. It's basically like an air show. So they do an air show twice a week where they shut down the McCarran airspace for like 15 minutes they have a demo pilot, I'll uh, volunteer to take that position, just raging in an F-16 twice a week, and it's an air show for all of the Vegas Strip. Get everybody out on all the balconies of all the condos and just make it happen, because why not? You know what I'm saying? All right, we're coming in low level. We'll get aligned with the Strip here. We're nice and maneuverable. Don't have a ton of bombs on us. And here we go. There's Las Vegas Boulevard. Just going to follow it, map of the earth style. I've actually done this before, uh, once or twice. They shut down the strip for us to come do photo shoots. I haven't done it this low, though. So this will be first time uh, doing it this low. <laughs> oh, you look good. What's up, Stratosphere? Yo, yo. All right, all right. There we go. We got some condos. Got Circus Circus. And we got the Trump Tower. Loving it. Looking good. Flying right through the Mirage. Do a knife edge pass through here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All day long, baby. We'll come back around, get the other side of the strip. Underneath this crane first. Just don't hit the little pulley underneath. <laughs> oh, it's so fun. Watch out for towers. All right. I don't want to get much faster than 500 bills, though. Alright, now I'll bend it back around. And then I'll do a simulated flame out approach. Either at McCarran or Nellis. We'll see how our gas is looking. Alright, bending it around. Oh yeah. McCarran Airport right there. That would be shut down for us doing this maneuver. So we're not uh, competing with Southwest. <laughs> or Delta. All right, coming back in. Should have the Luxor coming up. You have got the altitude warning, obviously. Underneath that crane there, Luxor to the left. Looking good. New York, New York. What's up? Oh, man, what a dream flight this would be. <laughs> man, what an epic, epic flight this would be in real life. All right, let's see if I can bend it up and around the Trump Tower. Rolling back out. Boom. All right, and now we got Circus Circus underneath us, and Stratosphere coming up. We'll bend it around that as well. Pylon turn around the Stratosphere, baby. That's just fun. That's just good fun. The one thing I did really love about being on the Thunderbirds was you basically had a license to steal, where they would shut down entire chunks of airspace to practice and so I did a lot of photo shoots here around the Las Vegas Strip and it was just awesome we tried to time it one time to have the Bellagio fountains going uh, while we were doing our photo shoot <laughs> they actually did it. it it's pretty epic the things that you could do so there we go quick flyby of the strip Dang, this makes me want to go to Vegas can you guys turn the fountains on please fountains anyone anyone 
All right. Well, I tried. <laughs> All right. Let's do a simulated flame out approach here at Las Vegas International. Set up for that. Maybe one more uh, fast pass of the strip, and then we'll pull up. We'll pretend. I'll pretend like it flamed out while I was doing while I'm doing the uh, strip tour, and then we'll see if I can actually land it at McCarran. That'll be a good challenge. All right. So one more big. Uh, aileron roll for the people. We'll give them two. Got to give the people what they want. <laughs> and then we'll align, uh, I believe, for runway 2-1, a south-facing runway at McCarran. But we'll get fast. We'll get low. Haven't flown so much in Vegas. Vegas just holds a special place in my heart for sure. Continue to bend it around. 400 is about the minimum I want. I want to tap 500, though, just since we're doing this exercise. Little crane I'm going to go above. All right, and then we'll fly here. All right, right past the Trump Tower. Good flyby. The Mirage. What's up, Mirage? All right, now we're at 530. Okay, going idle. Oh, let's just simulate the flame out. All right, simulated flame out. I'm pulling up, trying to gain altitude. Pulling up as to not stall the jet all right we're gonna have to set it down without going over the runway because we are pretty slow right now and it'll be a left hand turn I'm gonna align myself to the north flowing runway I'm gonna wait on the gear okay we're simulated flame out we're align with this runway here all right here we go perching we're at 2.30. Looking pretty good. I don't want to get too far out here. I'm waiting on the gear, guys. Don't let me forget. <laughs> All right. Now I'm pulling it around. Altitude. Altitude. 2.80. That's pretty good. I do have good energy now. Altitude. All right. I feel pretty comfortable. Gear coming down. Speed brake's coming out. One last check of that. Yep, everything's looking good. 200. I'm gonna go for this runway on the right. Sorry, uh, Alaska Airlines, hold your position. <laughs> All right, yep. I know, I know, I know, I know. Just, just calm down. This is our one shot at it. We're gonna have to land a little long. Gentle, gentle. All right. All right, now I'm just gonna get the jet stopped. And the brakes should be working right now. I'll work on that. All right, so not bad. We landed a little hot, so we're gonna go off the end of the runway in this situation. But you know what? Sometimes a simulated flame out. We're down to 80 knots by the end of the runway. Not the worst situation that could happen. So there you go, there's the strip. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that rundown. I did. I really enjoyed it. If you would, please dominate the like button on this video. Subscribe to the channel. Tell me other things you want to see. I uh, hope you enjoyed recounting uh, some of my Finny flights. Those videos will pop up over here. Uh, I've got dog fights against MIGs. Just just the fun stuff. All the, all the basic necessities that you're going to need just to make your life a little more fun today. <laughs> I mean, seeing an actual fighter pilot shoot down some MiGs in a digital combat simulator, epic. Uh, thanks to DCS, Digital Combat Simulator, for making this sim. It's, it's really good. Um, it's almost too good. <laughs> so uh, dominate the like, uh, the like button, guys. Subscribe to the channel. That would help me out a ton. And most of all, watch one of these videos that will pop up over here. That will help me out a lot. All right, I'll see you in the next video.